Okay, so now Bantam. Bantam, uh, we had an A Cup rematch in week one where the Warriors crushed the Raiders 32 0. Heard a bit to see that result, but I know you were happy with that one, Jesse. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I still got a lot of friends over there with the Warriors coaching. Uh, um, Paul Stewart, Tim uh, Shahan, uh, Joe Papalia, Carl Andre, a few of these guys we featured in our uh, HESN original blog series, Coaches in the Community. Make sure you check that out on, on the website, hesn.co, when you get a chance. And if, if anyone listening to this has a coach that they'd like us to feature, just fill out the information, uh, send an email, whatever it is, get in contact with us, recommend somebody, we'll feature them. Yep. Um, so... So in Bantam, I mean, the big thing is uh, that I noticed the takeaway is, is Cumberland shot from number 11 up to number two. So what I want to say is how, how come they moved up, even though they had a big win against Vikings, what was your thinking of, of putting them right up there and, and, you know, not letting them climb it slowly throughout the year? Uh, they, we had them at the bottom or towards the bottom to start the season, but, I mean, a 52 nothing win – you got to respect that. I mean, okay, fair enough. A lot of big, big names there uh, um, that have decided to come back into the football football scene. The um, Christian Villeneuve, the quarterback, um, uh, had been doing some seven on seven. I know he's training with Gridiron. Um, Justice Karate decided to uh, to play Bantam as opposed to going to high school St. Pete's. Yep. Um, uh, Breezer, the running back, all these guys have come back to play, and I mean that team's going to be hard to beat. Um, and I know, I know. Last year, uh, that that core lost in the championship to the Giants at at the uh, uh, Pee Wee Division. So they're going to be looking to go get their claim yep. their A Cup. Yep. Uh, I wonder, you know, who's going to be the team? Do you think at this point it's early? I know, but like, at what point? Who's going to give them a shot of 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 stopping that high powered offense? Uh, give it a chance to the Warriors. I mean, they posted a shutout themselves. Um, the Raiders, they they want to step up and prove that this past weekend was hopefully a fluke for them and come back and post some strong victories. Yeah. And you know what the, uh, the, I was, I was impressed with um, the Wolverines Bantam team. They pulled off a win against uh, uh, the Bengals yep. and you know, it's the same type of Wolverines team that you see year in and year out. It's, it's pound them ground, rock them, sock them like power dive uh, <laughs> football and they chew the clock down, but you know, They'll explode. They got a few players that can that can uh, that can make plays on on special teams. So you know if they can get ahead by 10, 10 or fifteen points, that's all they I need. mean that's all they really need. Yep. So that'll be an interesting one now.